Hey everyone, I'm Osu, and this is Pokemon Yellow, and um, I think this is amazing, I'm doing this. I like this game. This it was one of the first Pokemon games I ever played. Yeah, I'm going to be talking over Professor Oak here. I just want to kind of get past this bit there too quick. So, yeah, Pokemon Yellow is like one of the first games that I ever played, as I can remember. You know, playing on the Wii Game Boy Color, along with Super Mario Bros. Deluxe on the Game Boy Color. That was like a... That was basically just a remake of the original Super Mario Bros. So, for name, I'm just putting in my actual name. That's... It's not really a big deal or anything. I mean, it's already been reviewed on Little Big Planet and some, some UV and BC stuff. It doesn't bother me at all, really. It's just a name. However, that's not the same case for my rival here. No, because his own grandpa forgot his name, it's somehow I've been trusted to give him a new name. And I don't like my rival very much. So I'm going to give him... Wait, no. Sorry, I'm... I can't spell my rival's name. Which is what I'm giving him. Nachos! Yes, I'm calling my rival Nachos. Get used to it, it'll be throughout this whole let's play. So, let's get into this Pokemon adventure that could go really good or go horribly wrong. Anyway, step one go to PC and take one potion that I may or may not need. Hopefully I won't be needing it too soon. Leave the house, just walk out. Go in the grass here. Hey wait, don't go out. That was close. Wait, Pokemon love and talk grass. Too late, we're under attack. We're under attack from a little mouse. And Professor Oak just manages to capture that Pikachu, no bother, he didn't weaken it or anything like that. But still. So we, so yeah, we need our own Pokemon to protect us from wild Pokemon, even though he didn't have any Pokemon on him, he just flung a Pokemon and to that problem solved. And there's Nachos. Grams, I'm fed up with waiting. Nachos, why are you here already? I said for you to come by later. Ah, whatever, just wait there. Ha, huh, I more respected the, the new nachos. His own grandpa doesn't even like him that much. And yay, we get the Pokemon near the table. Be patient, nachos, I'll give you one later. Go ahead, it's your- Yay, we get to go get our first Pokemon. Also, I'm just talking to Professor Oak. Let's go get our Pokemon. And somehow, before we even have time to grab it, Nachos manages to push it out the way and take it from us. Yay! Nachos snatched the Pokemon! And instead of doing anything about it, Oak just lets him have the Pokemon. And... We just get the Pikachu. Do I want to nickname Pikachu? Yes. Since I don't like Pikachus, and I'll probably end up using this. I know exactly what I'm going to call it. Yep, King Moron, and somebody, somewhere will hopefully get that reference. Anyway, so we can go out now, we've got King Moron with us. And Nachos is just challenged us to battle. Yeah, your first battle. Nachos. And he sends out Eevee, so, yeah, we could have gotten an Eevee 
and she's got a Pikachu. That kind of sucks because I like Eevee and its evolutions. Definitely more than Pikachu, so which is cool. Use the shock and hopefully kill it. And it just keeps using tail up to lower defense. That is slightly worrying because that means I could take a lot of damage here. Hopefully, though, Nacho is, is retarded and just keeps using Tail Whip. I paralyzed it, yes. <laughs> Still just using Tail Whip. It hasn't even attempted to try Tackle yet. Yeah, you level up. That's the good thing about winning this rival battle, though, you don't actually need to win the rival battle. Well, this rival battle at the start, anyway. I picked the wrong Pokemon. You didn't pick anything, you stole that Pokemon from me. You little bugger. Smell your later. I'll smell your later nachos. Would you look at that? It's odd, but it appears that your Pikachu dislikes Pokeballs. <laughs> you should just keep it with you. That should make it happy. You can talk to it and see how it feels about you. How do you feel about me, King Moron? King Moron not impressed. Oh well, he, he never was impressed, was he? So yeah, we can go out now and train. Hmm. Though I won't be doing training, don't worry, I'm just gonna show off some wild Pokemon. Do one or two battles. Most of my training's gonna be off screen. It's just really when I'm going through places that I'll show you know when I'm grinding up, leveling up, that that's all off screen. So yeah, out of King Moron and that's good. We'll eventually get more Pokemon. So yeah, we saw Pidgey flying to Pokemon weak against Electric, so we can take that easily. And Rattata, that I think Rattata and Pidgey are the only two Pokemon we'll find around here, uh, or find for a while actually. I think the next thing we'll see is like maybe a Carpy or Metapod or something like in Viridian Woods. Could be wrong about that, but I'm pretty sure that's all we're gonna be seeing really. And I don't really like Rattas, it's not really a Pokemon I think it's that good, and I don't think Rackets that good either. You dude, you're just trying to walk into that bush or something, you're weird. What's your problem? See those ledges along the road? It's a big s it's a you no, know, it's a bit scary, but you can jump from them. You can get back to Pallet Town quicker that way, yeah, so... That still doesn't explain why you were trying to walk inside a bush. Now let me try and see if something happens. Nope. Jeez, now I'm the moron. No, I'm not. King Moron's the moron. So there's the Pokemon Center. Here are Pokemon there. Pokemon Mart buy stuff there. So we'll go up this way, and you can't go through here. This is private property. Private property, my ass. It's a public road. Let's talk to you. Oh, Grandpa, don't be so mean. He hasn't had it. Has coffee yet? See, the way it makes it sound, it sounds like it's just telling our Grandpa that we haven't had coffee yet, which is true. But no, she actually means that uh, he hasn't had coffee yet. So. We'll go in the Pokemon Mart. I'm surprised I remembered to come in here and do this. Hey, you kid from Pallet Town. You know Professor Oak, right? His order came in. Will you take it to him? And you just gave me the parcel, so I don't really get a choice. Why bother asking me? Instead of saying, will you take this to him? Just say, take it to him. Don't ask why, demand how. Or... Well, that's not exactly how it works in this case, but don't ask. Yeah, don't ask, just demand, basically. That's the moral of the story. But the moral of the story is that a Nachos is retarded. Retarded Nachos. <laughs> retarded Nachos. In, the rea in reality, that sounds so weird. Yeah, so this is definitely Oak Slab. Why was I thinking it wasn't? Oh, Andrew, how is my old Pokemon? <laughs> Old Pokemon, you just caught this thing and then gave it to me. Yeah, here, take the power, so. This is the custom Pokeball I ordered. Thanks, Andrew. By the way, I must ask you to do something for me. And that just comes. 
and that my Pokemon has grown stronger, check it out. And it was good timing. I need to ask both of you some for me. On the desk, there's my mention of Pokedex. It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught as a high tech encyclopedia. And Renato take these with you. It's dangerous to go along. Take a Pokedex! Now that Zelda reference didn't go in too well. Okay. I'm sorry about that. I kind of regret that now. So. It's it, but I don't need you. I know. I'll borrow a town map from my sis. I'll tell her not to lend you one, Andrew. Ha ha ha. Ex exclamation mark. As if it's a apostrophe mark instead of exclamation mark there. But, now, yes, Nacho's big plan. Get a town map from his sister and tell her not to give us a town map. We go talk to Nacho's sister. Grandpa asked you to run an errand. Here, this will help you. And we got a town map. And this is the time out to find out where we are now. This is one thing I'd like to point out in Pokemon games before I end this episode. Item. Town map. Here is. It's a town map. Yet it shows us the whole region. So it's a town map that shows us more or less the whole country. Also, I am not very good at. Oh, wait, I can move around the map. It's only pushing up and down to check the different locations. Yeah, that's how this works. Okay, that's weird, but apparently that's how it works. So I'm gonna probably do some training and then next time stuff. We'll try to get past the old man at least. So I'll see you next time. And let's play Pokemon Yellow. King Modern, what the hell are you doing?